Wow, look at this fog. It seems we've reached the limit of the communication range. I see. From this point onward, we'll be swallowed up in the vast darkness of space. Then this is our final farewell. Are you sure you don't want Lloyd to know? There's no need. Lloyd and I said our goodbyes before I left there. My place is in the past. I'm counting on you to look after the World Tree. Of course. Um... I thought you set up a barrier. He's the summon spirit that I told you about. He is Ratatosk, the summon spirit we met back then. That's probably why the barrier didn't affect him. I'm sorry. It looks like I'm interrupting. No, we are the ones who should apologize. It was we who betrayed your trust. Lord Ratatosk's memory of your past meeting is currently sealed. Ah, a Centurion. It's been quite a while. The world has changed a great deal while we were asleep. Indeed it has. But Lloyd and his friends seem to have straightened out all the problems we left behind. Who are you? I am Kratos Arion. I travel with Daris Karlon into the depths. Kratos is an old companion of mine. I've kept him informed of what's transpired on this world since he left. And in turn, he's done the same for me regarding our companions who've moved to Daris Karlon. Please do not mention anything about him to Lloyd or the others. In any case, this is the last contact he has with this world. Yes. I hear you and Lloyd are traveling together. Yes, he's helped me a lot. Please look after Lloyd and all of his friends. Yes. We're about to lose our communication link. I'm afraid I must say goodbye. Farewell, you and Carfe, my friend. Farewell, Kratos Arion, my friend. Um, what's Daris Carlon? It's the name of a world very far away from ours. They say it is the native land of the Summon Spirits and Elves. Right now, they're roaming the universe, looking for somewhere they can live in peace. So Kratos is on Daris Carlon? Yes. I'm not sure I totally understand, but I hope they find a place to live in peace. I do as well. Sorry to keep you waiting. Don't worry about it. Thanks for coming. So, how is your father doing? Mm, much better, thank you. He's stable now. They're going to transfer him to Meltokyo's prison soon. Oh, I see. When this battle is all over, I'll need to head over there and receive punishment as a member of the Vanguard as well. You too? Yes, of course. I guess first I'll need to dissolve the Vanguard in Daddy's place, and then I'll serve my sentence. And after that... After that? After that... I'll find a different way from the Vanguard to bring peace to Silverant and Tethaala. Colette and the others will help out too. That's great. I'm sure you can do it, Marta. I just... I wish there was something that I could do to help out too. So I guess... Since you're the guardian of the Ganungagop, you would need to stay there and protect the door. Yeah, probably. Then I guess we'll never see each other again after this is over. Yeah. Tell me so!
something. How can you just stand there and act so calm? I guess I really don't mean anything to you, even after all the time we've spent together. No, Marta. I, I didn't mean it like... Emil, I... I want to stay with you. <sighs> Marta... I don't care if you're a summoned spirit. I know who you really are. You've always tried your best. And that's the Emil that I love. Oh, Marta. I... I... I don't know what to say. Marta... You've always been there for me. And... And I... Marta, I love... with me after you've regained Ratatosk's power. Huh? That way, I'll be able to see you whenever I want to. Marta. But I... I don't have any summoning abilities. I promise you. Huh? Look, I don't know whether or not I'll be able to see you again, but I'm a summoned spirit, and I'll always exist in this world. And as long as I exist, you'll always be in my heart, no matter what. Always. Even if you grow up and find somebody else to love one day. Emil, don't be stupid. There won't ever be anyone else for me. Are you ready? Yes. Richter's at the Ginungagap, right? Yes. He has most likely made a pact with the demons to defeat you and is waiting for you there. Not just Richter. Alice, Dex, and the rest of the Vanguard members who still follow him will be there as well. Right. But to reach the door that connects to the demonic realm, we'll need to go to the Ginungagap. Isn't that right, Emil? Yes. Everyone, let's do this! Yo, Emil, there's something I've been meaning to ask. What is it? Listen, you never hesitate to ask Regal or Rain for their opinion. And now that you've met Lloyd, he's your regular best friend. So why don't you ever come to your old buddy Zellos for advice? Uh, well, I guess I just didn't think to. Is that bad? I'm not calling it bad. I just don't get it is all. It's not that I don't value your opinion. But not only are you older than me, you're also the Chosen. I guess I was a little intimidated. It's ironic that someone called the Chosen One would have self-esteem issues. I could seriously have you roasting on a spit right now. I must say, your cooking has truly come a long way. How can you tell when you don't eat? Anybody could tell by looking at it. Just look at this turnip you carved in the shape of a dove. Once I get going, I can't help myself. And this turtle is made from a pumpkin. It's a veritable work of art. 